Hola chicos, Harry here from Chat Spanish, teaching you useful Spanish things you might need on your Spanish journey. Today we're going to be looking at the difference between these four things. If you do think that's going to be interesting, do like the video before you've even finished it and subscribe to my channel. It means a lot to me. Um, let's get into it. Por qué? This means why. Hence, we've got the question marks. Remember the double question marks in Spanish, one upside down, one normal one at the end. Don't know why they do that, but this is the correct way of saying it. You probably have seen this. ¿Por qué? Why? So, for example, ¿Por qué no te gusta el fútbol? Why don't you like football? Accent here, really pronounce that. And it's an accent because there's emphasis on it. It's a question. Why? ¿Por qué? ¿Por qué no te gusta el fútbol? Why don't you like football? ¿Por qué? Is because. So I've started with the two most common ones you've probably seen. ¿Por qué? No accent here. All one word. That means because. So why don't you like football? ¿Por qué es aburrido? Because it's boring. Double R. Let yourself go. R. ¿Por qué es aburrido? Because it's boring. All right. Now we're getting to the more interesting two. This one. El por qué. So this is por qué. One word. Like we've just seen, but it has the accent here, which changes the meaning completely. So this does not mean because. It has the accent on the E and it's one word. And I've included the article here. I've included the the, the L. El por qué. Because I want you guys to remember that's the reason. El, the reason, the cause. All right. So if we look at this in a sentence, um, you know, why don't you like football? Because it's boring. The first person could then say, no es un buen por qué. That's not a good reason. It's not a good reason. So por qué here, one word with the accent on the E, is reason. No es un buen por qué. It's not a good reason. And then finally, chicos, por space qué, por qué. This means why or for which. Por qué, all right? So there's no emphasis here. It's not por qué. It's just por qué, all right? And you'll see that in a sentence. So, why don't you like football? Oh, I'm not very good at it. That's not a very good reason. And the person could say, well, no juego bien. Esa es la razón por qué no me gusta. No juego bien. Esa es la razón por qué no me gusta. Oh, I didn't even translate that. I'm going to have to do it for you now. So, I don't play well. I'm not very good at playing football. Esa es la razón. That is the reason por qué for which no me gusta i don't i don't like it all right why or for which porque that is the reason why that is the reason for which i don't like it so those are the differences between porque why porque because el porque the reason and then here porque why or for which all right and just keep practicing it it will come i guarantee that so i do hope you find this video useful subscribe to my canal it means an absolute, it means a lot to me. Um, and like the video, leave comments below and do watch this other video I've attached um, about uh, one of my favorite phrases in Spanish, which I think you like. Hasta luego, chicos. Ciao.